Thanks, Lyricalient. Let me see. Okay, let me look through the library. Let's take a gander. Let's take a sniff. Um, this is what I have. How do I like all games? There we go. Oh yeah, I forgot about this. True. Thanks, not Omega. I played Spellbreak. No, I didn't. I just installed it because um, I was I was gonna play with uh, Brandon, but then I went to I went to nap. I was like, never mind. <laughs> Wait, where is it? <laughs> yeah, no. Yeah, this is the site I pirated all my games from. Here's Celeste. Uh, Dead Rising 2. You see Origins? <laughs> Don't ditch me again. <laughs> you are not the Apex Legend. I'm the Apex Champion. I am the Apex Champion, not you. Um, why do I have this? Thanks, Emmy Tofo. Easy dub. Just cause three. Simp Brazil. King. Oh, Jump King. I'm not playing that. No, fuck that game. I'm not interested. <laughs> Mafia. Bunch of Metro Phantom Pain. Those are such big ass games, though. Fuck. Those are big ass games. Like, big ass games. 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 That's it. I mean, I'm down to play Witcher again on stream. Because I never played it. When did I win last time? 2019. That was... That was like two years ago. Have I played Stanley Parable? No. How long is this? I, I don't know anything about it. I know it's like a guy talk to you. Okay, we'll play this while it installs. I know the guy talk to you and he goes like, <laughs> I'm a game, lol. Thanks, DJ Run. It's fairly short. Okay, that's fine. That's perfect then. Then I want to think- I need to think like what big ass game I want to do next. Lo, I'm a game and I make fun of you. Play. Let's play this message again. Resolution. Why do they not have. They don't have 1080? Oh no, it's the aspect ratio. Okay, there we go. Pog. The aspect ratio. Um. Okay. I 
Everything's true garnish. Now what? Subtitles? Oh, fuck. I'll wait for it to load. It's loading. Click to skip. This is the store. I don't think I should have skipped that. Sorry, that's my bad. Um. Okay, I'll, I'll restart. Don't worry. No, it doesn't let me! All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. No My flat hard, Stanley? Stanley looked, he couldn't find a trace of his co-worker. Oh, please. Are you really just doing this for the achievement? Click a door five times. I don't times. fucking know, bitch. I don't know. I have to no. click everything to make sure I don't I miss can't anything. Just give these merits away for such little effort. A measly five clicks. Now suppose you were to click the door 20 times. I would say that's the kind of effort that warrants recognition. Hmm. I have to say, I'm still not feeling the satisfaction of witnessing true effort for a noble cause. Perhaps 50 clicks will do it. Yes, almost certainly 50 clicks. Anybody keeping count? No, no, I'm, I'm still not feeling it. I, I want this achievement to have meant something. It has to be a, a true reward for valiant effort. I want to see some hustle, Stanley. I want to see I'm hustling. A willingness to go I'm hustling. I'm, hu I'm hustling. I'm hustling. I'm hustling. Why don't you go put 20 clicks into door number 417? Thanks, Broke Blue. Never mind. Four one seven. Was that username access? Huh? Input received. I'm turning. Oh, I'm turning them off. Save power. Hey, that's the room. Thanks, Piccolo is my stepdad. Oh. Now, go click a few times on door 437. No. I don't want to go back. Actually, no, I'm going to go back. Excellent. I think we're getting somewhere. Now, door 415. Let's give it 10 clicks or so. 415. Now, back to door number 437. 437. Do I have schizophrenia? Let's see. How about you click on, well, I don't know, the copy machine? All right. Back to room 417. I'm really feeling it. I clicked now. it. I, I clicked it. it. Somewhere. Okay. Okay. Now go climb on employee 419's desk. I can't jump. Yes, this is great. You're putting it all on the line, Stanley. I like that. All right, let's keep it up. Go give me a few clicks on door 416. 416. We've almost got it. Now the copy machine. <laughs> oh, the copy. This, this guy's a great hype man. Where's the copy machine? I gotta go back. Right here, right here. Finish it off, Stanley. Oh my god, he's coming. Clicks on door. Yes, we did it. Oh wow, that felt amazing. Yes! I can't be loud. 
Nothing could hold you back. Yes, I'm very proud of how far we've come today. Just think, only a few minutes ago, you believed an achievement was worth five little clips. I didn't think that. He was wrong. I'm thinking. I didn't think that. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. This was not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge right. first, just to admire it. I don't trust this guy. He has a weird accent. Ah, yes. Truly a room worth admiring. It had really been worth the detour after all, just to spend a few moments here in this immaculate, beautifully constructed room. Stanley simply stood here, drinking it all in. Yes. Wait, 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 you guys hear that? Even though I'm not in front of anything, I'm clicking and it's just so utterly captivating that even There's a sound. your co-workers have mysteriously vanished. That's supposed to be there? What am I clicking? And some paintings. Really worth it. Am I walking around with my keyboard? At this point, Stanley's obsession with this room bordered on creepy and reflected poorly on his overall. It's just the sound? It's possible that this is why everyone left. Maybe it's because I smell bad. Hey, come here often. But at last, he'd had enough of the amazing room. No, I didn't. took the first open door on his left to get back to business. What's in here? Stanley was so bad at following directions, <laughs> it's incredible he wasn't five years ago. Whoa! Do not jump while the car goes in motion. But in his eagerness to prove <laughs> that he is in control of the story, and exactly. Him what to do? Stanley left on the platform and plunged to his death. Are Good they? job, Stanley. Everyone thinks you are very powerful. I am extremely powerful. I'm back. All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. Hello, Bassett, Rita V. Keep closing the door in my face. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, How about this I was don't not the correct way to the down. meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, just to admire it. Wow. Yes. This room. What a beautiful room. What a gorgeous, gorgeous room. Thank goodness Stanley had taken this detour on his way to the meeting room. But eager to get back to no! business, Stanley took the first open door on his left. Also, I was going to see if he was going to close the door if I stood there. What if Stanley I do the same thing? Stanley was so thing? bad at following directions, it's incredible he wasn't five years ago. But in his eagerness to prove that he is in control of the He doesn't have any story, different dialogue. To tell him what to do, Stanley left he doesn't have a... And plunged to his death. Good job, Stanley. Everyone thinks you are very powerful. What? What did I think? I thought he was going to say something else. Someone was following Stanley. He was sure of it. If he checked over his shoulder now, he would surely catch them. It was only a matter of time. Stanley's a little bit special. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, this was not the correct way to the Thank you, Zero. And Stanley knew it perfectly well. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, just Maybe to Maybe he says a it. different thing third time in a row. The lounge was sublime, a work of art. But eager to get back to business, Stanley took the first open door on his left. Thank you, end of the end. Stanley was so bad at following directions, it's incredible he wasn't five years ago. Look, Stanley, I think perhaps we've gotten off on the wrong foot here. I'm not your enemy, really, I'm not. I realize that investing in your trust in someone else can be difficult, but the fact is that the story... What? Really? 
I was in the middle of something. Do you have I zero parkour. consideration for others? Are you that convinced that I want something bad to happen to you? What? Yes. I don't know how to convince you of this. I gotta but go. I really do want to help Thanks, you, to show you something beautiful. Really? I don't believe Let me him. prove it. Let me prove that I'm on your side. Give me a chance. Never played this before, no. Now listen carefully. This is important. Stanley walked through the red door. Aha. Perhaps you misunderstood. No. Stanley walked through the red door. I'm colorblind. I still don't think we're communicating properly. Stanley walked through the red door. All right, fine. Go ahead, Stanley. You want to know so badly what's out there? You want to find out what lies at the end of this road you've chosen? Well, don't let me stop you. You see? There's nothing here. <gasps> I haven't even finished building this section of the map because you were never supposed to be oh, here in the fuck. first place. Broken rooms, Sorry. exposed developer Thanks, textures. Thanks, Yuko, and your promises. You wanted? Was it worth ruining the entire story I had written out specifically for you? I'm a bug tester. Do you don't think I put a lot of time into that? Because I did. And in the end, it was all for nothing. Because this is what you wanted to see. Help me here, Stanley. Help elucidate these strange and unknowable desires of yours. What would have yeah. made this game? I'm not ruining the what game. What do you want to see? Vehicles? Skill trees? Yeah, I want Work I want to wake up in the back of a wagon. Nothing so far. Of a horse Tell carriage. You, let me take a stab in the dark at a new design and you can give me some feedback. There we go. A third option. This already feels leaps ahead of where we were before. Go ahead, Stanley. Take it for a spin. It's a trap. There's no choice. Okay, I'm going to stop you there. Now, tell me about your experience with this new version. Would you say that the game benefited from allowing you more choices? Feel free. No, to because the choices I'm are the same. For some real critical feedback here. A one. I mean, I can understand. One. You saw ways the game could be improved to. It's the illusion of choice. All three doors led to the same That's place. That's even helpful. What am I supposed to do with that? Uh, but I guess it isn't my place to judge. Here, based on the data from your previous playthrough, I've compiled a new version. And to be perfectly candid, I think I've knocked it out of the park with this one. Let's take a look. Did he build something new? I might go in here just to see if it's the same thing. Now... Would you what say the hell? It's the same thing. Helped you feel motivated to keep walking through doors. Trash. Again, answers, please. Hey, I nearly forgot. I've got a prototype of a new game. Why is he, why is he like? He sounds so close. A lovely opportunity to give it some play testing. You wouldn't mind taking a look at it, would you? Perfect. Let me boot it up. I missed it. In this game, the baby crawls left towards danger. You click the button to move him back to the right, and if he reaches the fire, you fail. It's a very meaningful game, all about the desperation and tedium of endlessly confronting the demands of family life. I think the art world will really take notice. But of course, the message of the game only becomes clear once you've been playing it for about four hours. So why don't you give it four hours why don't I just hack to make this sure game? it's effective? Be sure to keep notes on your experience. Yes. Me because if it's I for hate that, I what babies. To do. I'm completely out of ideas. I can't think of a single thing that might improve the experience for me. I'm not even going to try. I'm out. I'm out. I'm done. It's over. What? Thank you. Get me out of the room. Your input was extremely valuable. Oh, hey, since my game was so awful, why don't we play someone else's game? 
just to ease the pain. I just finished playing Let's someone see. else's game. What do we have here? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Game yes. scripted. This seems like it'll work. Let's give it a shot. What is it? <gasps> well, Stanley, is this any better? At last, the one thing you <laughs> always desired. A game I had absolutely nothing to do with. Nice! Let me speed run this. Tell me that, Stanley. Will it ever be enough? Well, I'll say this. I'm done making I can't even jump. From now on, I will only create to fulfill a greater artistic purpose. Watch this, Stanley. I'm going to build a house. A house? <laughs> Where? <laughs> this will go here. No, here. And then... Let's see, what does it need? I, uh, yes, of course. And just to finish it all off, yes. No, I was going to go it's in. It's complete. I made this standing. Look at you it. You made this? Gaze I made upon this. upon my work of art and feel ashamed at your own inadequacy. I can make something ah, better. But you've only seen it from the outside. You've only gotten half I made this. You, you made this? Step inside and make yourself comfortable. Okay. Isn't it grand? Isn't it perfect? It could only be better if... Wait, that's it. We must rebuild it out of well, You diamond. see, I only... Diamond it's just far quiet yes, houses. Yes, yes. Come along, Stanley. We have to go mining. Okay. I can't jump. <laughs> it's like a cover. I guess they can't use the official music. Oh my, it looks like it's going to get a bit dark. Have you brought a light? No, oh, that's the old gravel texture. I don't have a light. Oh, no, 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 no. This is far more open-ended than I had in mind. I'm looking for something more narrow and linear. Something that makes you feel utterly irrelevant. This won't do at all. One out of five. Wait, I heard... Even the diamonds couldn't save this one. Okay, new game. I can't... Uh, are there spiders? What about the diamonds? <laughs> dun, dun, dun. <laughs> yes! I don't even know what this game is, but I love it. Dun, dun. You trapped dun, dun, in the glass dun, dun, box dun, dun. no way out. For the good of all of us and the whole of it. I couldn't have done it any better myself. What is this game even supposed to be? I can't figure it out. Okay, now I'm curious. Let's go find out what the hell this is. They watch me poo? Oh, it's a puzzle. Hey, it's Critical supposed to drop. Thing, there we go. I can pick it up. Genius. Nice. No, actually, you know what? I think what the fuck? Crazy. I really don't care much to see you stumble through anymore. Guy? Guy. Guy. Thanks, daydreams. Feel alone. Hello. <gasps> Light. What's going on over there? Is it like a streamer setup? Give me a zan.
blow. Blow. I wonder what he found. Mm. If what he wanted was to be the leading man in his own story, well, perhaps he's gotten it. Down in wherever he is right now. I wonder if he's happy with his choice, and if he's learned the heavy cost that comes with it. He'll understand soon what I was trying to tell him. He needs me. <gasps> Someone who will he's wrap right. up at the end to make sense out of the chaos I need the him. fear and the confusion. Otherwise I That's get scared. I that is what I mean to this world. Oh yes. Yes, I'll be back. There's no other way. Once this ends, after it all comes to a close, then I'll be back. The end will be here soon. Very soon. Okay. I can wait. Oh. oh. What? It ended my game for me? What a bunch of bollocks. All of his Wait. Co-workers were gone. Is this what always here? Mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. Was that paper always there? No, it wasn't. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, this was not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. It wasn't Perhaps there. He to stop by the employee lounge first. Just to admire it. Standing now in this incredible water. room, standing for the first time, I understood get some water. true happiness. Then the feeling went away, and he felt sad again. Then it came back and lingered for a minute or two. Now it's only half there, just a kind of um, tingle. Yes. Really, really worth it being here in the room. A room so utterly captivating that even though all your co-workers have mysteriously vanished, here you sit looking at these chairs and some paintings. Really worth it. At this point, Stanley's obsession with this room bordered on creepy and reflected poorly on his overall personality. It's possible that this is why everyone left. <coughs> what is this? Rum. Stanley sat around waiting for more dialogue. But when a long time had passed and there was no more, he decided that oh, the game was trying to send a message. nasty no I don't drink that was gross <sighs> ice cream strawberry cheesecake what does it taste like like rubbing alcohol Mm. Oh my god. Wait. I think I'm so dr Dude, bro. I think I'm faded. Bro, I think I'm faded right now. Bro. I, ca I can't. I can't use. I can't use a spoon, bro. What the fuck? Bro, I think I'm wasted. <laughs> no, that's not 
not how I hold the spoon. It's just, it's really because it's frozen. I think it's Mad Enten and Daydreams. I shouldn't eat too much. I'm gonna get the pissy shitties if I do. <laughs> the fist spoon. I can't get it. It's frozen. Put the microwave, put the metal spoon in the microwave. Hell no. The video of the kid microwaving his, uh, his phone to charge it. This isn't my ice cream. It's just uh, the person who bought it forgot about it, so it's mine now. <laughs> you drank my rum. <laughs> I made him add that emote just so you guys could use it. Thanks, Rheingar. The best way to eat frozen ice cream, I just figure out, is to use a fork instead. <laughs> I was saving that for later. <laughs> this is a smug face. Thanks, oh my Brad. Wait, there's, oh my God, there's like biscuit parts in this. It's so good. Oh, that's enough. One more bite. Mm. I'm not gonna ass blast. Look how much I've eaten. That's barely. Thanks, Key Chris. <laughs> Already too much. <laughs> Literally, no one's eating this. One more. With the crust. Alright. Put it away. No one will know. No one will know. Make sure no one will know. Thanks for Loonly. For the eight glizzies. But at last, he'd had enough of the amazing room. I did. He took the first open door on his left Fine. to get back to business. And so he detoured through the maintenance section, walked straight ahead What's to this? the opposite door, and got back on track. Bring the ice cream. The ice cream that was pretty good ice cream. But still, we're not going. Want to go back to the office. He wanted to wander about and get even. Yeah, I keep going to like creepy dark so places. So in order to get back, he needed to go um. Uh, 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 
Why do I keep going to like dark and creepy places? Here it's um left. Left. Oh no. Oh no. no it's fuck. To the right. Okay. Shit. Sorry. No. Oh fuck. No, sorry. No, okay. No, oh fuck. Oh shit. Said it was to the right. What was I thinking? It's clearly. Oh dear. Would you hold on for a minute, please? Now let's see. We went down. What is the point of that XQC down. bait emote? It literally looks exactly the same. Yep. Yep. Okay. Okay. Yes. I've got it now. This story is absolutely. They should have just took in his mood and then rotated it to look up. That would have been like way more. That would have been way more. Mm. No. What no, the fuck no, no, is no, no, this? No, 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 no. This isn't right at all. You're not supposed to be here yet. This is all a spoiler. Oh my god, it so is. Close your eyes. Okay, 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 okay. We just, we just. Have to Are these all the endings? Oh, who am I kidding? It's all rubbish now. The whole story completely unusable. How about rather than waste spoilers. my time trying to salvage this nonsense, we'll just restart the game from the beginning. And this time, suppose we don't wander so far off track, hmm? Okay, from the top. Do I keep tasting the alcohol even though I literally just licked it? And I tasted the back of my throat and it feels All this fucking gross. Was gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. <sighs> I have really bad taste aversion to alcohol. When Stan wait, wait, what? Huh? No, I no, I restarted. I swear, I definitely restarted the game over, completely <sighs> fresh. Everything should be. Isn't this this supposed to be two? Stanley, did you change anything? I literally didn't do anything. I'm too dumb. Monitors? Did you move the story somewhere or? A Hold on. Why am I asking you? I'm the one who wrote the story was right here just a minute ago. I know for sure that it's here somewhere. Okay then. Uh -huh. It's an adventure. Come Stanley, let's find the story. I feel like a little kid. Like this guy talks to me like I'm a little kid. <clears throat> I got to stop going in the d creepy dark places. Oh, okay. Hey, wait a second. Is it sir? Am I drunk? I'm not drunk. It's just I taste it. Like I still remember I'll the say taste it. very. This is the worst adventure I've ever been on. It's a fucking you, office. There definitely was a story here before. Do we just? Do we need to restart the? Game? <laughs> Why would I be? Well, I Why out. would I be drunk? By starting over and over again. I literally <laughs> licked it. This. Okay, let's give it a shot. Why not? Okay, the papers All are... of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. I'm blasted. I am absolutely bla... Dude, I... I okay, I yep, it's worse. I might be remembering this wrong. It's I think possible I'm the story is I can't even walk straight. came from. Why don't we go back the I other came a walk straight and see if we missed anything? Everything's so wobbly. Why is it th I can ew, it just like I f it tastes gross. No, I haven't been at the bar today. I don't go to the bar. Uh -huh. I knew we'd miss something. The story. Here it comes. <laughs> lol, what? Is it, that emote basically looks like lol, what? No, wait, never mind. Not the story. Okay, Where the let's fuck head are back we? The other way and retrace our steps. <laughs> Ice cream contains 0.03% of alcohol. Why am I always in like the fucking murder shacks? This shit is creepy. Now this, well, I'll be honest. I don't recognize this place at all. Is this the story? I don't think so. I can't quite recall, but I believe my story took place. Flash is supposed to play Wolf Among Us. What is this? Is oh, you know, you're only like mm. five hours late. You remember, Stanley? Stupid bitch. What do you know? What? Since I've completely Dumb forgotten bitch. what we were supposed to be doing, how about this? 
You win. Yeah! Congratulations! Yes! Who's the winner? Who's the winner? Really paid off. I'm the winner. Good job. I'm the winner. Oh no. No, I don't feel right about this at all. Why not? I know you didn't put in any actual work for that win. No. Some people win fair and square, and this was not one of those situations. Okay? I'm getting weirded out by whatever this place is. I'm getting weirded out what too. Might this time, I have to restart. Okay. Every time he restarts, it means I win. All right. I've got a solution. This time, to make sure we don't get lost, I've employed the help of the Stanley Parable Adventure Line. Nice. Just follow the line. How simple is that? What if I don't? No, no, I'm down. We're leaving it up to the line from now on. He doesn't. I can't do anything else. <laughs> it kind of sounds like a fart. <laughs> you know, when I was a kid. <laughs> When I was a kid, my sister told me if you open one of these drawers and close them really fast over and over, <laughs> you get cancer. And I believed her. <laughs> and, and I started doing it because I wanted cancer because I was sad one day. I was like six or seven. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go get some cancer. <laughs> you see, the line knows where the story is. It's over in this direction. Onward, Stanley, to destiny. Though, here's a thought. I was I six years old. That be our destination, even if there's no story there. Or to put it another way. Is the story of no destination? I'm not drunk. <laughs> Simply by the act of moving forward, are we implying a journey such that a destination <laughs> is inevitably conjured into being by the very manifestation of the nature of life? I literally okay, licked Sam, it. I need to follow this train of thought for a minute. Just stick with me. Now we can both agree that the nature of the. I mean, I also is smelled it. Is it possible to hotbox alcohol fumes? Of that existence, right? Okay. Now, if my experience of your existence rests inside of your subjective experience of this office, is this office, in fact, the skeleton of my own relative experiential mental subjective construct? Whoa, 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 whoa. Hang on. That got a bit weird back there. What the fuck well, like is going on? Not sure where I was going. Oh, I was, I was supposed to keep moving? You know what? I think what we need right now... <laughs> the bottle was the full before I took know. it. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Shaking it. Motorsport. Put that thing in the what the fuck? In the court. Motorsport. Put that thing in the court. Motorsport. Motorsport. Put that thing in the court. Motorsport. My stomach feels weird. Cut the music. Go back and look at that fern. Is this a fern? Stanley, this fern will be very important later in the story. Really? Make sure you study it closely and remember it carefully. Okay. You won't want to miss anything.
think my hand, my hands smell like alcohol. I did not chug half the bottle. Wait, what? We're back at the office? No, no, no. I don't even My, know what is a parable you know means. We're looking for the Stanley Parable, right? The story? Is any of this ringing a bell? Why is the rum gone? I don't. What's a parable? What the fuck? We're back here? Oh no, 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 not again, Line. How could you have done this to us? And I really trusted you. After everything we've been through, you... Oh, I can't take this anymore. To hell with it. Restart. Oh, Adventure Line. This is still the same iteration. You know what, Stanley? Oh, no. I forget the Adventure Line. What's it ever done for us? We're intelligent people, right? Why can't we make up our own story? Something exciting, daring, mysterious. All. This all sounds perfectly doable. Why don't we simply start wandering in... Well, I don't know. How about this direction? Okay. Thanks, Bear. Now, yes, this is exciting. Just me and Stanley forging a new path, a new story. Well, it could be anything. It's a circlay. A story to be. Go wild. Use your imagination. Whatever it might be, Stanley. No, it changed. I'm ready for it. Okay. Uh, so once upon a time, there was a a rabbit and then the rabbit was very fast oh no not oh, you again no. stanley i'd also like to veto the line from having any role in our awesome new story no lines or monitor rooms just don't acknowledge it and we should be fine am i actually wasted fuck yeah bro i'm wasted i'm actually i'm I'm gonna chundi. I'm gonna chundi. I'm gonna chundi. <laughs> ah, a choice. We get to make a decision. I'm gonna, I'm gonna From chundi. I'm gonna chundi. Our control. How important we mustn't squander the Chun opportunity. Chun fact, not... I believe I need a minute to think here. Chundi means to like throw up for being minute. drunk or something. Okay, so I know that each door has to lead somewhere. Which means that somewhere, the place where we're trying to go, there must be a reverse door that leads here. And that, in turn, means that our destination corresponds with the counter-inverted reverse door's origin. So starting from the right, let us ask, will taking the right door lead us to where we're going? And since the answer is clearly yes, then by all accounts, the door on the right is the correct one. Another victory for logic. Come, Stanley. Our destiny awaits. Whoa. Oh, hold up, what's this? Hmm. Aimless hmm. wandering. A confusion ending. You're telling me that's what this is? It's all one giant You've ending? We've been playing it for 16 so minutes. We're supposed to restart the game eight, eight times? After a long time, Stanley dies. All this goes? It's all determined. So now, according to the schedule, I restart again. Then what? Am I just supposed to forget? Well, what if I don't want to forget? My mind goes blank simply because it's written here on this this thing wall. Hey. Well, cross-eyed and bear. Why do I get to decide? Why don't I get a say in all of this? Thanks, Blue really Boy. No, it can't be. I, I don't want it to be. I, I don't want the game to keep restarting. I'm I don't want I to forget for what's going on. I don't want to be trapped like this. I won't off. restart the game. I won't do it. I won't do it. I won't. All of his co-workers were... Wait, no. This isn't the right office, is it? Is this Stanley's office? Yeah. No, the papers have been gone. It wasn't in the. Oh no, the last one was the same ending. 
When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he... This was not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, just to admire it. Stanley felt lightheaded. Butterflies in his stomach. I do feel lightheaded. In a way he had never known before. Was it this room? A connection between the two? Could a man love a room? I mean, truly, truly, deeply, madly, um, love. I just, I see this. Yes, really, really worth it being here in I the room. I sniffed it. But eager to get back to business, Stanley took the first open door on his left. Okay. And so he detoured through the maintenance section, walked straight ahead to the opposite door, and got back on track. Yet there was not a single person here either. Talk he less to unbelievably believe Stanley decided to go up to his boss's office, hoping he might find an answer there. All facts, no printer. Thanks, Luju and Hyperversity. Oh wait, it changed. using slides to assure employees everything's okay. Make sure they have a slick blue graphic. Throw some bevel. Nice. Nice, very diverse. Okay. Number of slides on the slide. There's one slide. Rate at which charts on the same slide to pick the same information. What? Rate of increase in graphs per slide. Please, oh my god, no more charts. Boss appreciation minute. Circle the top 20 things you love most about your boss. <laughs> this is some Jeff Bezos shit. If you ever find yourself in conflict, it takes two people to start a fight, and right now you're both of them. What? I don't get it. Success. Wow. Less air. Metamorphosis. Clear skin. Hope. A boat. Anybody want a boat? Coming to a staircase, Stanley walked upstairs to his boss's What's office. What's downstairs? Another murder shack? Press this button. No, that's a light. Ooh, but Stanley get just couldn't get do in it. the car. We're leaving. He considered the possibility of facing his boss, admitting he had left his post during work hours. He might be fired for that. And in such a competitive economy, why is this game scary? Risk? All because he believed everyone had vanished. His boss would think he was crazy. Thanks, Johnny, and Billy, to Johnny. Maybe, he thought to himself, maybe I am crazy. All of my co-workers blinking mysteriously out of existence in a single moment for no reason at all. None of it made any logical sense. And as Stanley pondered this, he began to make other strange observations. We're in a loop. For example, why couldn't he see his feet when he looked down? Why did doors close automatically behind him wherever he went? And for that matter, these rooms were starting to look pretty familiar. Were they simply repeating? No, Stanley said to himself, this is all too strange. This can't be real. And at last, he came to the conclusion that had been on the tip of his tongue. He just hadn't found the words for it. I'm dreaming, he yelled. I don't have this a mouth. This is all a dream. Oh, Ma I don't have a mouth. Stanley felt to have finally have a found mouth. an answer, an explanation. I don't have a his mouth. His co-workers were actually gone. He wasn't going to lose his job. He wasn't crazy after all. And he thought to himself, I suppose I'll wake up soon. I'll have to go back to my boring real-life job pushing buttons. I may as well enjoy this while I'm Motor sport. So, he imagined it. himself flying and began Ooh, to gently float he... above the ground. Dude, I love I love when I get to do that in dreams. Soaring oh. through space on a magical star field, and it too appeared. Wow. It was so much fun, and Stanley marveled that he had still not woken up. How was he remaining so lucid? Oh. And then perhaps the strangest question of them all entered Stanley's head. 
One he was amazed he hadn't asked himself sooner. Why is there a voice in my head dictating everything that I'm doing and thinking? Now the voice was describing itself being considered by Stanley, who found it particularly strange. I'm dreaming what the about fuck a voice is going describing on? me, thinking about how it's describing fart. my thoughts, he thought. And while he thought it all very odd, I lie down. he wondered if this voice spoke to gas. all the people in their dreams. I've gas. It's from the ice cream. That of course, this from was the... not a dream. <laughs> Dude. How could it be? Was Stanley simply deceiving himself? Believing that if he's asleep, he doesn't have to take responsibility for himself? Stanley is as awake right now as he's ever been in his life. Now, hearing the voice speak these words was quite a shock to Stanley. Is this guy done speaking his essay? Beyond a doubt that this was in fact a dream. Did the voice not see him float and make the magical stars just a moment ago? How else would the voice explain all that? It's Jesus. This voice was a part of himself too. Surely, surely, if he could just... He would prove it. He would prove that he was in control. Thanks, Leo. That this was a dream. So he closed his eyes gently, and he invited himself it's to wake been a up. While. Okay. He felt the cool weight of the blanket on his skin, uh -huh. the press of the mattress on his back, uh -huh. the fresh air of a world outside this one. Let me wake up, he thought to himself. Awake his sesame. I wish it to be over. Let me go back to my job. Let me continue pushing the buttons. Please, it's all I want. I want my apartment and my wife and my job. Really all have, I, I have want a is wife? my life exactly the way it's always been. My life is normal. I am normal. Everything will be fine. Thanks, Kawab. I am okay. Okay. Uh oh. Stanley began screaming. Please, someone wake me up. My name is Stanley. I have a boss. I have an office. I am real. Please, just someone tell me I am real. I must be real. I must be. What the fuck going on? Who am I? Who am I? And everything went black. This is the story of a woman named Mariella. Okay. Mariella woke up on a day like any other. She arose, got dressed, gathered her belongings, and walked to her place of work. Wait, but what? But on this particular day, her walk was interrupted by the body of a man. That's me. Who stumbled through town Stanley. And screaming to himself, and then collapsed dead on the sidewalk. And although she would soon turn to go call for an ambulance, for just a few brief moments, she considered the strange man. He was obviously crazy. This much she knew. Everyone knows what crazy people look like. And in that moment, she thought to herself how lucky she was to be normal. Fuck I that bitch. Saying, no one's normal. I am in control of my mind. I know what is real and what isn't. No one's normal. It was comforting to think this. And in a certain way, seeing this man made her feel better. But then she remembered the meeting she had scheduled for that day. The very important people whose impressions of her would affect her career, and by extension, the rest look of the, her Look life. at the resolution on she her hair. No time for this, so it was only a her her, her ponytail looks there, like a raccoon's tail. Down at the body, and then she turned and ran. She didn't call the ambulance. Good call. That would have been crippling debt. I have to go. My head hurts. My head hurts. Oh. And I have to uh, poop, I think, and fart. And, you know. Anyways. Anyways. Wow. Big stretch. Big st Oh my god, I got a fattest wedgie right now. Holy fuck, it's digging into my asshole. Oh god, I'm never doing that again. Goodbye, everybody. Bye bye. Big stretch. Big stretch. Big stretch.